out, up and about. Welcome, everybody. Yeah. First off, let me Thank say, you. beautiful ladies. And oh. real quick, because we only have just limited time on this one. There's a certain concept that's been making rounds that people are talking about, especially on the international scene. And it's about something called ectolife. Now, ectolife is a provision where you can actually have a baby outside of your normal natural self. It's a good thing for, it's a good concept for people who have been trying to get babies or perhaps maybe people who want specific kinds of babies. And that's where the, you it know, beats. the lines start to get blurred. Yeah. Um, because they're saying that you can engineer your baby. You can make them have blue eyes, dark skin, mm. this and that. You can make them be this and that uh, at certain mm. ages. You can kick in traits. So you're taking apps to reality where exactly. you can create Exactly, you're making virtual somebody. babies and then actually making, mm. you know, so there are lots of questions that have been raised, lots of ethical lines that are being, you know, uh, um, crossed and all of that. And people are like, this might just not be the best for humankind because you never can tell what could... Have you ever heard of a malfunctioning baby? Uh, when you start engineering and playing with I'm life. I'm on breast. I'm on breast. I'm, I'm on breast. breast. I'm on breast. <laughs> oh, wow. Mary, you went there. I'm glad but, she's a mother and I'm not the one who said it. I did it. No, but seriously. <laughs> But Maybe. seriously. On the baby's mouth, you teach class on the mother's nipple. Hey. You said malfunction. Those are the kind of things that could happen. Ladies that and gentlemen, a unfiltered baby. <laughs> a fully functional baby, that is. But this is a question. That that was, as if much as anybody we... was genetically engineered, <laughs> Mary, when, Mary. They, when they were engineering her, yeah. <laughs> they removed some things. Yeah, they did. <laughs> like what <laughs> icy went out. <laughs> And then Mary just happy. Ah, they removed, yeah, let's, they removed, let's the, fil they removed the vocal filter let's from get, Mary. Let's, let's talk about something. I told, yeah. I told, I told, I told, I've mentioned this a number of times. If your dad, if you're still alive, or maybe your grandfather, mm -hmm. if they see what the world is today, mm -hmm. it will blow their minds. Mm -hmm. You even have great inventors, great minds of the Renaissance era, mm -hmm. saying things that are... I mean, you, you, you've heard someone like, uh, I can't remember now, I think it was Bell, I can't remember if it was Graham Bell, I'm not very sure, mm. who said that you can never get images to move. Mm -hmm. Talking about the concept of the television. True, mm -hmm. true. Motion they will picture. say things now yeah. that in 50 years will be history, yeah. If we are still alive by yeah. the providence mm. of God, mm. it will blow our minds. Mm. Mm. I told you about it a lot, but I, just yesterday, I found out something on, just chat GPT-3, people yeah. are also talking about five. Yeah. Elon Musk. Fact, you know who Elon Musk is? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. He has he warned. And mm -hmm. a thousand other people have warned a petition yeah. Yeah, to, to stop, stop the AI. development. Yeah. For someone like that, do you know yeah. who that man is? Mm -hmm. He gave his child a, a, a digital name. <laughs> <laughs> you know My point is, I put yeah. together something, I'll show you it's guys a warning, where yeah. I was setting the prompt. My point is, this will happen mm. and we'll have greater things. Yes, mm -hmm. we'll have mouth. For, I mean, you. Anyway. So, so, so the issue is, um, over the over decades, people have been trying to, in a sort of way, engineer their own children. They've wanted um, more uh, enlightened children. Well, when they go to sperm banks, they want someone, a, a, a donor that has high IQ, yes. that is tall, that is dark skinned, that is light skinned, or blonde, or so. They've already been trying that for decades, and nobody has questioned mm -hmm. that. Mm. Um, there are some people who would prefer to have a child of another race. Yeah. Yeah. It's based on their experience being a certain race. It's a choice. Um, but then for those who haven't been able to bring life themselves, it might be a source of joy for them. Mm. That joy, no matter where it comes from, having a child is like, it's like no other. Well, you see, the thing is, Titi, we have already ha we have alternatives for that already. People who can't bear children by themselves have surrogacy as an oh. option. There are other, you know, uh, what they call them? IVR. IVR. We have yes. Adoption. But the, the questions that begin to be raised now is when you start to go into the min into the min the mitochondria. Let me be a scientist and start to engineer specifics. You know, traits. Same move thing. chromosomes here and there, replace this and that. It's the same thing. What would happen to the physical nature of such a person? It's the reason why Can cloning, so cloning has... Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. That first sentence was oh, epic oh, enough. Okay, okay, okay. It was good, it was all right. Good, talk, see, let's go, let's go. I was actually going to talk about cloning. Like, cloning. Cloning yeah. was like the beginning of all of this. Yeah. And now, I just feel it's crazy. Can't you find ways to help people that have lost their arms or their hands? All those are on the way. They're already working. There are ways, but they should, like, Maybe I, I want go. these eyes. I want <laughs> these eyes. Yeah. We gotta go, Mary. Yeah. <laughs> well, oh. 
First off, let me say that there are certain good things when it comes to these um, notable um, advancements in, in, in technology. Know, technology yeah. if, you call it, if you call it technology. Like, for instance, people are beginning to turn to these options for certain cures, like the cure for cancer and all of that and everything. And they're on the way. But my own, and I will still say this as a biologist, so when you start to mess around with that cell, mm. one, two, three, four, AGTG, you, you, wow. <laughs> you wow. might just be brewing something else that you All have. right. In any case, tell us what you think. Use the hashtag Wake Up Nigeria on TVC. We'd like to read from you. We'll take a quick break and we'll be back with more. <laughs>